has finally come. I can't wait one moment more. And I know that I have to show Henry, um, but um, she don't have time the next couple of days, so I will have to do it myself and then show her after. But you know, that's just more night wish, right? So you probably already have guessed it, it's time for the greatest show on earth. Since my first Nightwish reaction to Ghost Love Score, I have been flooded with amazing comments uh, about this specific song that I have to do it and it's very grand and I should be excited and it's like the 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 third and last um, part of the, tr the symphony trilogy as far as I get it. So I will watch this. Um, also, I will probably show Henry the Poet and the Pendulum before I show her this, but eventually they will all come. So good things comes to all who wait. And I just want... I, have, I haven't done this before, but I thought it would be very nice. I usually don't highlight any comments, but I just want to highlight these, which was from my last Nightwish reaction, um, because those... Like, m most comments make me smile, I love interacting with you, hear about your opinion, even though it's different from mine. I love seeing, like, people interacting, dis discuss discussing things and agreeing and disagreeing, as long as the, of course, tone is polite, and I feel like it's mostly on my channel. But these specific comments just made me extremely happy, and this is one of the big reasons why I have this channel. Uh, it's because it's so much joy and fun, and when I see comments like this, that I actually have a somehow do I'm doing something that has a positive impact on other people it's just amazing and it's totally worth everything so thank you so much for those comments also thank you so much to my patrons my little patreon is growing and I'm excited because the faster it grows the closer I get to be able to live stream in there because uh, I want us to be a bunch of people before I stream and also people are starting to uh, request songs and artists that I don't know of yet. So it's pretty exciting. So thank you for that and please join if you want to support the channel. But also if you really have a, a, a wish that you want to uh, me to react to. As some specific artist or, or uh, artist in general or a specific song and video. Um, so thank you from the bottom of my heart to my patrons and the link will be down below. Enough, 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 enough. Now we have to just jump into the reaction. After seeing Ghost Love Score and The Poet and the Pendulum, I know that this will be a ride. So I have tried to ment mentally prepare myself. Let's go.
after sleeping through a hundred million centuries, we have finally opened our eyes on a sumptuous planet, sparkling with color, bountiful with life. Within decades, we must close our eyes again. Isn't it a noble and enlightened way of spending our brief time in the sun? To work at understanding the universe and how we have come to wake up in it.
potential people who could have been here in my place, but who will in fact never see the light of day, outnumber the sand grains of Sahara. Certainly those unborn ghosts include greater poets than Keats, scientists greater than Newton. We know this because the set of possible people allowed by our DNA so massively exceeds the set of actual people. Thus, from the war of nature, from famine and death, the most exalted object which we are capable of conceiving, namely the production of the higher animals, directly follows. There is grandeur in this view of life, with its several powers originally breathed into a few forms or into one. And that whilst this planet has gone cycling on according to the fixed law of gravity, from so simple a beginning, endless forms most beautiful. And most wonderful have been and are being evolved. Okay, well, where to be in? Um, so, this was. Okay, let's start from the beginning. It was such a nice way this whole symphony started. I love how it was quiet and the, the instruments that was playing, like the symphony orchestra style, and and then the space. The, the quietness, it was like, uh, there was this universe theme and it was just this mas magical creation like energy and it just lasted for minutes and it was just amazing and then suddenly um, 
I think I I said that uh, earlier on that um, that I expected this to be the Big Bang, <laughs> and it was literally the Big Bang. I feel like it was um, we were in outer space and the Big Bang happened, and then evolution happened, and then we, there was this these fish in the background and snakes and animals, and you had these this very primal theme and how incredibly fun and creative and nice it was that they were making these noise uh, there was these um, animal sounds and then they added on to it while Flo was singing some upright, upright. it was so primal, so beautiful and then we moved up and up and up and we saw like uh, civilization, humans uh, and it was just like a story of yeah um, life as we know it as far as I, um, that was my perception or experience, and it was just gorgeous. Um, no wonder that it, this was a long symphony because it had to basically describe the evolution of humans, at least, or just like maybe planet Earth or no universe as we know it. Well, anyway, it was grand. It was big. It was beautiful, and that intro I just had chills all over. And then when Flo was saying that. Um, when she hit those high soft notes and it was all dark and you could see like this universal theme I just it just hit me so hard it was unforgettable I was like whoa let this moment last um, and then with the when the big bang hit it was I was actually uh, there was like some pre um, bangs and I was actually getting a little shock every time um, and I just loved how they just came on hard and then this effect with floor singing and it was amazing the si the harmonies she was not the only one singing here and to hear the other mus musicians uh, of Nightwish also join in great voices amazing so like theoretical uh, and dramatic and it just played perfectly together with Flo's voice it was stunning and then to hear her sing and then with like an, uh, a diva like underlying voice it was this di di demonic uh, grand uh, kind of effect and then the even grander uh, chorus it was just an explosion of amazing uh, different parts and and again like one thing is that the music on its own is amazing but the the, the vibe man of this this band you can just see them have so much fun and I, I couldn't help like just for the first of all I absolutely adore him and second of all when he did the ch -ch, um, perfectly sync with the rhythm of the song I was just like it just went straight to my heart I I loved it uh, that's that's a perfect sum up of the energy just warm heartfelt authentic uh, family like uh, doing what they love to do, doing what they're here to do, it was just like, oh her. And then the whole theme about uh, oneness, being one, and uh, the fact that we're even alive is a miracle and we should just like enjoy it to the fullest. It was just, it could sound cliche when I say it like that, it really does, but the way they were like managing to express it through music and the words and like the like kind of poetry input, it just worked so well for me. And also uh, ending up with with these uh, words of wisdom, brilliant. After they have like bowed, and I also noticed that even like the bow, might wish it was like long. Um, they were like so humble, and yeah, that's that's the thing. They they seem to be very humble uh, in a very authentic way and just grateful. Um, good, good good energy all over the freaking place and again I, I know I've heard Flo sing a couple of times but she still I still had some different phrases in the song where she just um, her voice just amazed me uh, and of course her presence and yeah now I finally finally learned that she's not she's not headbanging she is windmilling like yeah windmilling um, and uh, <laughs> I mean, what's not to love for these people? Not only are they extremely talented, they have created something that gathers so many people that 
and, and has such a strong message and just gives you this beautiful and forgettable experience and at the same time they seem to be such genuine good people but of course they their music their performance um, the amount of people they gather they it's just a direct reflection of uh, of who they are and like an extension of their I don't know goodness greatness love care the connection the oneness Oh, I could, I could talk forever about this performance. Um, uh, yeah, one of my favorite parts was like the primal setup with with the animal sounds, uh, where the band joined in. For me, it was just brilliant and magical. And again, they can just do some like it's just un unexpected because the created creativity, the created creativity level is just so freaking high. Um, for these people in this band, so you never know what you really get. So it's really just you lay, you, you basically, you know, lay lay back, focus, and you then just are taking on a journey, and you have no idea where it's going. But you can be sure that it will be one unforgettable and two extremely um, intriguing. Yeah, I, I I can't wait to show Henry this <laughs> this performance because she was amazed with the ghost love score and I love that performance amazing um, but I have to say this was this just was like extra special there was just something about those dimensions uh, with the animal sounds and also the the intro um, of the first part of this symphony that really took me somewhere out in the universe maybe hmm yeah, they had just have a, a skill of, of, of making music that goes very deep, like literally, <laughs> before the universe existed. I love Nightwish, I just, I just do. Um, and thank you for telling me to watch this performance. I enjoyed it immensely. And yeah, if you have some specific wish, as I said at the beginning, you can consider to join the Patreon. Also, if you just want to support the channel, otherwise you can leave a comment below i really want to hear what you think about this performance uh, and what you think about you know now i have my interpretation and i'm sure you um the, the rest of the army also has like their interpretations and i think we should just enjoy to have a chit chat about what we think about this performance um yeah so let's have a chat and I think I will probably go ahead and watch this again on my own now and I will see you very soon. Thank you so much for watching. I love you and I see you.